What's up, y'all? Today, I'm going to show you how I create my stuffed bell peppers. But let me tell y'all, it was a challenge going to the store trying to find bell peppers that didn't look deformed. Here's a picture of the bell peppers that I found at the store. As you can see, they're a different size and shape. I found some nice sized bell peppers, so let's get started. Here's a quick look at the ingredients that I'll be using to create this recipe. And I'll leave a list of the ingredients in the description box below. First, I'm going to start off by cooking my rice. Today, I'm using Uncle Ben's brown rice, but you can use wild rice or even jasmine rice. Next, let's cut off the tops of the bell peppers. Then remove the seeds and membrane and clean out the inside of the bell peppers. This is what it's supposed to look like when you're finished. And I want to repeat these same steps with the rest of the bell peppers. Grab a large pot and fill it with water. Then place in your peppers and let them soak for about five minutes. Then remove the peppers, set them to the side, and let them cool down. So I'm adding my ground turkey to my cast iron skillet while it's frozen. But as it continues to cook, I'm going to go ahead and chop it up into smaller pieces. On the side of the screen, there's going to be a list of vegetables and spices that I'm adding in with the meat. And I'm going to mix in these ingredients. Next, I'm going to season my meat by using basil, onion powder, black pepper, paprika, cayenne, chicken bouillon, and accent. Mix in these ingredients and let them cook for about 10 minutes. In my large bowl, I've already added in my ground turkey and rice. The next thing I want to add is cream of mushroom soup. Next, I'm going to combine the cream of mushroom with the rest of the ingredients, and this will form the stuffing for my bell peppers. Next, you want to stuff the bell peppers with the stuffing and you want to pack it into the bell peppers until the bell peppers become full.
The rest of the stuffing, I'm gonna set to the side and use it for something else later. All of our bell peppers have been stuffed. Now we're gonna to top them off with mozzarella cheese and place them in the oven for about 10 minutes or until the cheese melts. Here's our stuffed bell peppers. If you like this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to hit your notification bell and share my channel with everybody in your contacts. Bye.